So whatever has the most votes in 10 minutes wins. 35k. It's so cute. 30 minutes, letting me buy whatever in here. That's awkward. All right, hi guys. I'm sitting here in the car with little Molly, my little puppy. I'm about to go to the Apple store and I'm so excited because I'm filming a Apple store vlog today for you guys. I feel like it's been a while since I did one, but I know I say that like literally every time. By this time, I don't even keep track of all my Apple store vlogs. So today we're actually going to the Apple store to buy an iPad. So if you watched my videos a few months back, you know that I already got an iPad 9th gen but today I'm upgrading it to an iPad Air. So the reason I got the 9th gen in the first place was simply because of the prize. Are you hugging me? It's so sweet. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're so cute. Thank you. <laughs> I am being attacked. With kisses. So I had been looking for an iPad for real long but I was like I don't know if it's worth spending money on an iPad when I already have an iPhone and MacBook like I don't know if I need an iPad so I literally went with the cheapest option possible well but still a new iPad which was at that time the iPad 9th gen but I got it at Black Friday for 300 and something dollars which is like a super super good price for a fairly new iPad. It has like all the basic features of an iPad, which is great. But ever since I got that one, I've been realizing how good it is to have an iPad. I'm using it so much for like artwork and just like a lot of digital art, which if you look at the specifications, you can definitely see that the iPad Air is a lot better. For so I thought it would be a good like investment to upgrade to an iPad Air. So then the question is, what do I do with my old iPad? I thought about trading it in, so I'm gonna see how much I can get it for or if I should just sell it on a marketplace. That's what I did with my iPhone 12 when I switched to the iPhone 40 Pro Max. So instead of trading it in at the Apple store and getting like 300 I don't remember. Instead, I sold it at like an online marketplace for $700, which I never would have gotten from Apple. So I feel like I'm gonna do the same for this iPad. But yeah, we'll see how this turns out. I haven't even decided what color iPad I'm getting. So yeah, we'll see what we end up with. <laughs> Okay, so this is my current um, iPad 9. So yeah, this one still has the Touch ID button and no Face ID, so that's gonna be a really nice upgrade. And this one actually only comes in two different colors, so it comes in like space gray and Spare silver, so I got the space gray. It's a really nice color, but I'm super excited because the iPad Air comes in so many cute like, pastel colors, like pink or rose gold, I guess. I've actually been saying like that I hope the iPhone comes out in a rose gold again. I used to have the iPhone 7 Plus, I think it was, in rose gold, and that was like my favorite color ever. So I feel like like, I kind of want to get the rose gold iPad, but I don't know. Get it in purple. It'll match my phone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, but let's go into the Apple store. Yes. All right, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, look who's opening next to the Apple store. I think you should buy this one, yeah? Look at how big it is. The iPad Pro. It is. Let's compare it to my face. Put the iPad there next to your face as well. Is it that one? No, this iPad Pro. Oh. 35k. For 2 terabytes Wi Fi plus cellular. That's like 3,500, yeah. Or I should just get an iPad Mini. It's so cute. Seven it's so, so adorable. It was seven. <laughs> <laughs> but I already decided I'm gonna get the iPad Air, so I need to focus on, on that one. So these are the colors. Wait, which color is that? A gold. Um, 
I just accidentally dropped the Apple Pencil back there And you like cannot get it out That's awkward Oh my god Okay, but this is the purple one It's pretty nice But it like barely looks purple in this lighting Like here it kind of looks gray But then it's like gradient purple It's kind of pretty Alright, so I can't really decide between the rose gold and the gold iPad. I feel like the gold would be real nice because it would match with my iPhone 14 Pro Max. But I also like, as I've said, I've been obsessed with rose gold for so long. So I'm gonna let you guys decide on my Instagram. Let's see. Can I buy this? <laughs> you just asked home? me, can we buy this? What is it? It's a home phone. Home pod? I don't know what it does. You don't? <laughs> Wait, is it, it a, speaker? Like a speaker? It's like Alexa, right? Okay, sure. Uh, you pay? Uh, for one hour, no wait, 30 minutes, letting me buy whatever in here. No wait, you know what? 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Okay. Yeah, 10 minutes. We can Starting now. No, wait, <laughs> no. <laughs> no, okay, if this video gets uh, like 10,000 likes. Oof. It's not gonna get 10k whoa, likes. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> what are your videos getting now? Like a hundred. No, no I'm just kidding. Okay. Like oh, maybe like a good video, like a thousand. Okay, please, please get this video to 10,000 likes. Yeah, I wanna buy whatever I want from here. Yeah, please. If it gets to 10,000 likes, we can do a 10 minutes. You can buy whatever you want. Yeah. Okay, okay deep, wait. But... <laughs> <laughs> Cool. <laughs> All right, so I'm posting this right now. All right, so whatever has the most votes in 10 minutes wins. So far, it's been up for three minutes, and it looks like we're getting the rose gold. So my boyfriend really likes this Dior. What is this? Savage. Savage Alexiu. Perfume, but it's like two hundred and fifty dollars. Yeah. So he's like, it's worth it. So I got the idea. I'm gonna do another poll on my Instagram story and ask you guys if it's worth it. And if you guys say yes, um, he wants me to buy it for him. Yes. I didn't agree though. Yes. I please. <laughs> Smell this. It's good. Is it? Oh. Alright, so it's officially been 10 minutes, actually 11 minutes, and we're gonna check the results. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what is it? Wait, it's blurry. Oh, there you go. Okay, rose gold 74%, gold 26%. Alright, so I guess we're getting the rose gold. I really feel like this is gonna change though, because it was 79 at first for rose gold and it's like going down. <laughs> and that's like usually what happens. I feel like it's gonna be like 50 50 if we wait another like 30 minutes. But they close in 20 minutes. Yeah, so. we don't have another 30 minutes. Another. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go. Oh, wait. It's down at 68. Oh, sure. Yeah. Before we go home, we're gonna check the result for the perfume. Hey, okay, let's see. Oh, it's stone is 67. Check the other one. No. <laughs> All right, let's go. That's it. Good for me. Yeah, we're walking out with an extra iPad. I almost lost an iPad also because I, I left this. She left it on the table in the Apple store. Yeah, I forgot then, about like, it as well. I went to the other side of the Apple store and like, I didn't even notice. And then I was walking out and I was like, it feels so empty. Like, I, did I forget my phone or something? And I was like, my iPad. <laughs> but it's fine. We like, got the iPad. We got some birthday gifts for my mom. <laughs> All right, what we didn't get was the perfume. It's at 27% said yes, and 73% said no. That's because they have sorry. to smell it. They have to smell <laughs> yeah, it. That's true though, because like, it sounds like a really bad idea to get a $250 perfume, 
but if you're like actually fall in love with it and you're like I would say it's like it's almost worth it. Yeah, it we'll, is worth it. We'll get it at tax free. Always get your perfumes at tax free. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right, so I'm back home with the iPad. I'm so happy you guys decided for the rose gold iPad. Like, I feel like the color at the Apple store always look a little off just because of the lighting. They have like really yellowish lighting. It didn't really bring out the best in the color, but I think you can like see it here on the side. This is the color the iPad is gonna be. But anyways, so this is the iPad Air 5th generation, 64 gigabytes with Wi-Fi. I didn't choose cellular because I didn't know if I'm actually gonna use it. Usually you just use my iPad at home. I feel like this box is a little like scratched up, but it's fine. <laughs> I don't mind. I actually didn't know this, but apparently you can return an opened Apple products. So even if you like open the iPad and start it up in use it you can actually return it to the apple store uh, which i thought it was like if you open the box you can return it but apparently you can this means that i can actually use this for two weeks you have like 14 days so i can use it for a while and then compare this to my other ipad and if i feel like this isn't actually that much better than my older ipad i can just return it even if i used it which is really great actually oh and also um the prize this ended up being eight hundred dollars which i know is a little bit more expensive than in the u.s I bought this in Sweden, if if you didn't know, I'm from Sweden. Everything's just more expensive here, they add like taxes and stuff. But I also got a $70 discount because I'm a student, so I got like a student discount for $70. That was really good. I mean, it's not really like a lot if you compare it to relatively to the price but you know it definitely helps so i can like buy a case for that money instead and also as i said i'm gonna be selling this on a marketplace instead of trading it in i didn't trade it in because i checked the trade-in value and it was like 180 dollars for an ipad 9th gen and right now when I'm checking, the iPad 9th gen is actually selling for like $350, which is like the price I paid for this, but I think it's because I got this in the US and, and in Sweden it's already like $200 more expensive to start with. So I feel like this was a really good deal, like I basically have had this iPad for free. But alright, uh, I will make a separate unboxing video of this as usual, so definitely stay tuned for that. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. It was really fun going to the Apple store as usual. And yeah, I'll see you soon. Bye.